Did you see the uh, Jennifer Maya, Casey O'Neill greasing accusations? I did. UFC 286. It seems like maybe they've cleared the air a little bit. Casey broadcasting a direct message where oh, Maya yeah. seems to retract a little bit, saying at no time did I disrespect you. Maybe it's due to moisturizer. I use it too. That's the line for me. And I then complimenting use it her. Too. So Casey then you know addresses MMA Junkie, who had the reporting saying either they misunderstood the message or Maya's retracted her claim. Got me curious how often this happens in competitive jujitsu, Jimmy Smith, or at the highest level in the UFC, Megan Anderson. I guess I'll start with you. Does this? How prevalent is greasing in this space? I mean, I think it happens a lot more than people realize and not in like the most obvious ways. Like the ways that I have heard of it happening is like where you put on moisturizer uh, earlier on in the day and by the time you get to fight time, you kind of like it's kind of dried into your skin and you can't really test for it. But then as soon as you start sweating, like your sweat just starts, it's, it's almost slippery it's 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 kind of greasy if you will and i think it's a lot I, I can't confirm how often it happens but i think it happens a lot more than people realize don't you would you agree jimmy all right well, well first off it's not like phil moisturizes it's not like this like oh <laughs> no it's a process like you got to put a lot on you guys tend to wrap up and like sleep in it i've heard of that that they, they, they will literally bathe in it this kind of like Vaseline mix and bathe in it or whatever. So it really seeps into your poise. It's an intentional act is what I'm saying. It's not like, oh, I lotion up and then I go up. No, it's like you have to literally do a process to get it into your pores so it sweats out. And, and to Megan's point, you're like really slick. People don't admit to cheating, folks. Like even behind the scenes, like I've never had a teammate go, I'm going to grease tonight. Like, like so how no. much does it happen? Not many people admit to it, but... I mean, the most famous one was GSP, you know, BJ Penn, where they saw it rubbing on it, rubbing Vaseline on his chest, and BJ Penn would do these greasing right there on camera. So there have been instances <laughs> of it. It, it. it does happen. You guys don't remember that one? Phil, you remember that? Uh, yeah. GSP, BJ Penn. No, I remember yeah. that. I just, yeah, 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 yeah. I just yeah. said caught yeah. in 4K. Was that 2009 ish? Oh, yeah. But, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I Jimmy. think that's the problem. Jimmy's like, what? I need to go wrap that myself. I here. Jimmy, I'm going to write this all down. I'm going to wrap myself in moisturizer tonight. And, uh, we're saying can, moist can I, a lot. Can I, can I ask a question, though, Jimmy? So, like, obviously, like, yeah. you met, both of you mentioned a couple of methods that are used, right? And it seems to be effective in a fight. So why, why does this continue to happen? Like, why is this allowed? Why, why can people get away with this? It's not, it's not. Well, because the only trick they do is literally this. They rub your arms and go, okay, get in there. <laughs> yes. If, if it's yes. in your pores, they're not gonna find they it. Barely, it. It's, it's they that way because it's- They barely touch you, I swear. They barely touch you. So it's just easy. Like, it's not like loaded wraps, right? Someone's gonna notice loaded wraps. Someone's gonna notice, you know, something big, right? But like, Megan, to your point, they go here, uh, all right, you good. As long as you're not slathered in Vaseline right there, you'll get away with it. So it's an easy way to overcome the grappling advantage of your yeah. opponent, and it, it's, it's hard to catch somebody. Even after the fact, you go, oh, there's Vaseline on somebody else. It got on me. Like, it's hard, yeah. I was just yeah. about to say that, Jimmy. Like, you can't even test for it yeah. afterwards because you're supposed to be sweaty. Like, how are they supposed to determine if that's yeah. your nat natural way that you sweat? So uh, it's it's... It's so hard to detect pre and post fight. So how are they supposed to know? Sounds like we need a moisturizer sponsor to really yeah. land this thing. Guys, thanks so much for that. Uh, if you want more of moisturizer talk, ESPN.com. Talk to Phil Murphy. Slash MMA. <laughs> I have tips. Arda will help me. Talk to Phil. That's Phil pre-show every time. That's Phil. <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.